welcome to another unboxing. I am Woofy, this is Deadbolt Dragons, and what have we got here today? Oh, I don't know how to put this box of stuff. No, I got this t-shirt out, but it's not important, anyway. <laughs> Anyways, guys, this is a loot crate. Um, not sure on the theme, what have you, just reading the stuff right now. Um, Truth be honest, I went into my overdraft on the last Loot Crate box and I'm not sure if this is Heroes 2 or Villains, but we'll get to that in a sec. Um, it would be hard to beat the Cyber Crate, let's be honest. Um, if if Ashens is anything to go by, you'll know that Loot Crate until the Cyber Crate hadn't exactly been a good thing. So, let's hope this works up trumps, eh? Anyways, got my Tron t-shirt on, yeah. Optimus Prime, saw my belly, that's a sight that nobody ever wants to see except my girlfriend. Um, but anyways, let's get this box open, shall we, and take a look. Oh, incision. Scissors. Useful. Anyways, let's open this up and oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, what the, this is, this is quite clever, oh, well, don't know what that is, I don't, don't know what this is, I'm, I'm not sure, oh, we'll get to this all in a second, uh -huh. that doesn't happen, no, <laughs> maybe, Maybe. You know what I'm going to do with that. Bah. No. So. And let's have a look at the box, shall we? Look at all that goodness. Look at all that. It's very, very well designed. I give Luke Craig props for this. It's just it's designed as um, their Cyber Craig. And I do believe that this is uh, Heroes 2. Uh, I wasn't sure. Uh, hopefully I can get the villains box, but let's not count on it. Okay. Let's get that out of the way. Let's start with the smallest items first. Are you kidding me? You're not kidding me, are you? Hmm. Air freshener. You know what I'm gonna do now. Really, nigga? Okay, it's Star Trek, it's Spock, it's Leonard Nimoy, but it's an air freshener. Nerds who can drive, they'll love this. I cannot drive, I'm more of a Star Wars fan than I am a Trekkie, so, damn it, not a great start, let's be honest, but anyways, ooh, Legend of Zelda, hmm, now, not being the most avid of players of Legend of Zelda, uh, I don't know, I don't know what to make, it's a sweatband, I mean, I like it, Rational card, put that in the box. But it is a nice little sweatband. It's very, very nice. I see a lot of nerds wearing one of these. Oh, there's a label. There is a label, and I must read it. It says Legend of Zelda on it. Makes sense. But, anyways, uh. uh yeah. That can go on my wrist for the. Duration of this episode. Hmm, sad thing. No t shirt. It's sad. But I guess nothing could beat the awesomeness of Optimus Prime. <laughs> Anyways, uh, what is this? What the fuck is this? Oh, oh, oh. It's a batarang. It's a batarang. Batarang. Oh, it. Not just a battering, it's a keychain, it's a bottle opener. That pretty much gives away. 
Um, and on the tips, there's a flathead screwdriver. Hmm. And on the other tip is a crosshead screwdriver. That that's a nifty little tool. I might actually use that. It's got some heft to it. This is pretty damn heavy. Um, put that in the box with all the other things I've covered. Uh, what's this? Brawlhalla. Hmm, not quite certain what that is. Uh, platform Fighter Brawlhalla. White Fang Nash. Free to play platform brawler. Oh, right. It's free to play. I don't have Steam. I'm not that much of a PC player. But that is pretty. That, that's cool. That's cool. And pretty nice artwork design. I like that. That'll stay in there. Oh, what's this? Loot Crate Magazine. Uh, they got Batman, Wonder Woman. Zelda, I've made a fundamental mistake. Here comes the clip again. Really, nigga? So, let's try this again, shall we? Batman, Wonder Woman, Leonard Nimoy, just kidding, I know it's fuck, and Link. I bow my head in shame, I'm gonna turn in my nerd pass right this second. Don't deserve to wear that, I'm gonna put that over there. Sorry, internet, sorry, fellow nerds. I apologise. But, magazine. Heroes. Heroes on it. The next thing. The League of Regrettable Superheroes. The Loot Crate Edition. What is this? You know, it's like... I'm going to read the blurb on the back, but I'm just going to give you a hint there. Look up, up in the sky. It's a bee. It's a witch. It's... A giant eyeball? You know about Batman, Superman, and Spider-Man, but have you heard of Doll Man, Doctor Hormone, or Spider Queen? In the League of Ex Regrettable Superheroes, I almost said Extraordinary Gentlemen. That's one of my favourite films, and that will be a review shortly. Um, in the League of Regrettable Superheroes, you'll meet 50 of the strangest superheroes ever seen print, complete with backstories, vintage art, and colourful commentary. So prepare yourself for not ready for prime time heroes as B-Man, Batman. But the bees, the eye, a giant floating eyeball, just accept it, and many other oddballs and oddities. Oh, I wanted them to keep going with that rhetoric. Um, drawing on the entire history of the medium, the League of Regrettable Superheroes will appeal to diehard comics fans, casual comics readers, and anyone who enjoys peering into the stranger corners of pop culture. Seems legit. I might give this a read at some point. No, let's, let's have a look at it now. Let's have a look at it. Doll Man. Hmm. Phantom Lady, Lady Satan. The devil's a woman. Sorry, Satanist, the devil is a woman. Illuminati. But that's that. We're going to get to the uh, meat of everything. There's that joke again. Oh, what the bloody hell is this in a tube? Just... I'm sure that'll be used for cosplay related purposes. Well, and if I stop doing it. Oh! Oh! Wonder Woman! Wonder Woman in those. In that. Is it that wartime pose? Where the woman's got her muscle out? Oh, but I. I'm not sure, alright? I'm not that much of a history buff. Um, but, that's pretty fantastic. I never was a massive fan of Wonder Woman. Now, let's uh, say this right now. I'm not that big a fan of DC in general. I was always Marvel boy. But, to each their own, I'd be happy if you were DC or Marvel. Give me as much credit in the world for being who you want to be. So, that's that. Hmm. A lot of that stuff seems to be making up for the uh, making up for no T-shirt this month. Um, a bit worried about that, especially if the trade-off is a fucking air freshener. But I'm wondering what this is. Q-pop. Oh, oh! It's Adam West's Batman. Adam West. 
Nobody messes with Adam We. <laughs> oh, Adam West, you crack us up. Well, that's a, that's a good look at this. I mean, a bunch of nerds would be like, the only way you take it out of ruins all the value. Um, so I want to have a look at it. Alright, deal with it. There's your box. Um, oh. Oh, um, I tell you what, I'll just, um, give you that. I'll let you have a look at that. Just close up of Batman himself. I'm not going to take it out of the package because it is actually solid tape together. I'm scutting. I wanted to have a good one side of that. Um, but yeah, for now, that's going back in the box. If I can get it back in the bloody box. Guys, I'm hopeless. Um, well, thank you for watching this video, by the way, those of you that do watch it. Uh, Pokemon Week has been on hold. Um, a lot of my confidence has been drained from recent events in real life, and I won't divulge, um, but I'm getting prepared for Alcon in about a month, and there's other problems in real life that have taken my attention, and these videos have suffered because of it. But anyways, back to this unboxing. That was a good, good item. As much as I am not a Batman fan, and I'll be honest, I'm not. It seems DC has an obsession with him at the minute. And it's that right, of course, as he is the highest seller at the minute because of Arkham Knight. As much as I don't like Batman, I really want to play that game. And because of Gotham, as much as I don't like Batman, I love Gotham. Uh, Batman Q-Pop. Wonder Woman poster. Just gonna stand it up here. Book of Regrettable Superheroes. Loot Crate Magazine. Because it has more dignity than fucking air freshener. DLC code for Brawlhalla. Probably not gonna use it. Armband. Put this bad boy on, because I love it. Uh, Batarang multi-tool, love it. And then um, the wristband holder, I guess. Um, and of course, it would all not be complete without the box. So that's your lot, and I've got to say, I was really, really happy with this loot crate. Uh, okay, now I'm happy with this loot crate. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you for the next video. Um, the review will probably be on League of Extraordinary Gentlemen if I get myself in gear. Um, Pokemon Week will not be resuming until I'm ready for it. Um, in Memoriam will be on Rowdy Roddy Piper, God rest his soul. And my next rants, um, don't know when that will be or what it will be on. But I thank you for watching this unboxing video. I hope you've enjoyed it. I have been Wolfie. Peace. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and everything. And if you could for a moment to check out my other videos on my channel and if you haven't already subscribe and keep it here for Deadbolt Dragons. Peace. Really nigga?